Hey everyone, my name is Adelia Davis and I am the founder and executive director of Story Shifters. And I'm excited to be sharing with you all our first blog, Our Story. Now you may be wondering why we chose the name Our Story for our blog. In school, we learn a lot of history. Media has been giving more attention to her story, but this will be a place for our story. Society often tries to put labels and stereotypes on people of color, especially Black people, that can be negative and confining. And they can put children in a box where they think they can only be one thing when they grow up or only one way to be successful. But this will be a place to show the plethora and the diversity of contributions and triumphs that we've had, have, and will have in our future. So I invite you to get together in a group, maybe even by yourself, different ways that you can share what we are doing in our community and what has been done. So you can share the story of an ancestor, you can share the story of a group that's doing great things in the community today, and you can even share plans that you have and how it connects to what has been done. So this will be a place where you can share it in written words, spoken word, poems, song, dance, whatever, because we are more than just words written on a page. And that's what we want to come out in this blog is the creativity and the triumph and the greatness of people of color and our communities. This will be a place for us to feel empowered, to continue shaping, sharing, and celebrating our stories and the triumphs and the connectedness that we have because it's together that we are strong. I think about um, the late Nipsey Hussle's dream that he had of us collectively stepping into our greatness. And that's what I want this place, this blog to be. So I look forward to hearing from you all. Please be on the lookout for my blog post. I'll be writing about where my name, Adelia, comes from. And just a little preview, I'll be writing about how I was named, about, named after my maternal great-grandmother, who's from Berea, Kentucky, and all of the things that she did in her small community that had a ripple effect and continue to have a ripple effect in me and shape and influence what I'm doing today. So I look forward to sharing that with you all and also hearing from you. Please be on the lookout and read and contribute to our story. Bye.